We have a new look tonight at the Purple Line train, sparking some nervous excitement among Marylanders. They've long awaited the massive public transportation system, but still aware of the years of delays. Our Max Marcilla joining us live from Bethesda tonight. And Max, you spoke with uh, people there who are eager for the Purple Line, but definitely hesitant to get too excited. And Chris, that's because these people say they've been here before. We've all been here before. 2022 was the initial completion date that has since come and gone. But today was a visual sign of progress. On the streets of Bethesda, what are your first thoughts? Uh, it's good and that it's better than what we have. Excitement over the future. It looks fantastic. Oh, clean and tidy, modern. The future that we got to look at this morning. Maryland, we have a train. These newly revealed Purple Line trains set to start hauling passengers from Bethesda to New Carrollton and everywhere in between in the winter of 2027, now in the public eye. But getting here has taken years, with money being one of the biggest challenges and the delays it caused also on people's minds. People have been waiting for a long time for the Purple Line. Andy's Pizza in Bethesda, how can I help you? GM Shane May is among those waiting because she says construction at the Bethesda Metro Station has impacted business. On the weekends, we're busier on the weekends. I need more people on the weekends, and sometimes they can't get to work, so it's it's been a little bit frustrating. But still, it's worth it, she says. D.C. is like the Mecca, and Maryland kind of gets left behind a little bit, so this connects Maryland in a way that we need to. High excitement, some skepticism, only partially eased by today's visual confirmation of progress. I don't want to get my hopes up too high. Um, because it's been put off and put off and put off. Um, but I have faith that they're gonna rally and bring, like we actually saw the train. I think we're on a good track, hopefully. And again, the new estimated date of completion sometime in the winter of 2027. The next step officials say is getting the trains that you all just saw actually on the tracks. Reporting live in Bethesda, Max Marcella, DC News Now.